welcome to Corvallis, home to Oregon State University. Corvallis is a great place for biking, hiking, and great living. It is consistently rated the number one bike that the great country in the United States. Here's my school, Franklin K-8 School. I'm Mary Knight, the Oregon representative for the 2012 National Geographic League. And here is my hometown. Over there are the tennis courts. And tennis is one of my favorite hobbies. afternoon in Spain right now and guess what everyone there does? They have a siesta. A siesta is a period of day where working parents and school children come home, eat lunch, and take a two hour nap. I wish we were lucky enough here to have that. I'm on the railroad front, a classic place for the red, white, and blue festival which celebrates America's independence on July 4th. Many people gather here to witness fireworks. Behind me is the Willamette River, a major tributary of the Columbia River. It has major cities on it, such as Salem, the capital, Portland, the largest city, and Corvallis, the best city. I am standing on Bald Hills for Corvallis Travels. Just joking. I couldn't be a rich thief right now, but when I grow up, I'm going to be someone like Samantha Brown because I love traveling and talking. Outside of Corvallis, Oregon has many places to offer. Silver Falls for hiking, Multanama Falls for sightseeing, and of course, Crater Lake National Park, which emerged out of an erupted volcano. Need a good study tip? The best thing to do when you do geography or coral romance is you need to enjoy it. Not just with geography, with anything you do. Have fun with what you do and like what you do. Hmm, where would I want to go if I got a free ticket to anywhere in the world? <laughs> Indonesia! I don't want to go to Indonesia because it has very great tourist resorts such as Bora Bora and its beautiful scenery add to its majestic charm. Great place for food, and American Dream Pizza is one of the best. It's so good, even President Obama ate here. 